Lucamus Prime here, so it's time to react to If I had directed Star Wars Disney's Episode 5 by AJ Markle. This is for about um Podama, so yeah, without further ado, for Roman Full Screen and let's go. Alright. Hold on, then. One of the most popular pilots in the Resistance is Paul Dameron. Yeah, of course. He was raised in a family that basically helped out in the Resistance and fight against the infamous First Order. He is willing to fight against the odds and willing to be a strong leader. However, the writing of his character in the movies could be way better. Hmm, yeah, I'd agree. He deserved much better writing. Paul Dameron was one of the most popular characters in the Star Wars universe by the Disney trilogy. Yet, people don't really know about his backstory unless you find out that his parents were also part of the Resistance that were led by Han Solo. So, to kind of back this up a little bit, Let's go to Paul Dameron's backstory real quick. Paul Dameron was born on Yavin 4. His mm. mother, Shira B, and Cass Dameron, his father, were part of the Resistance during the time when they were against the First Order. Now, to keep this in mind, this concludes and proves that Poe became a Resistance fighter because of his parents. So, let mm. me explain a little bit about that if I directed it. So, as a young boy, his parents... Now, reminder, this is if I directed, were basically attacked by the First Order. Oh. Because of this, they would join the Resistance to fight against them. And of course, they had to leave Yavin 4. Basically, during his time around the galaxy, he would learn how to fly, he would learn how to fight, and he would also learn how to smuggle. Oh, yeah, nice. one more thing. His parents do die oh, in the no. Resistance. Because... The war itself against First Order is no easy feat. People will pass away. Anyway, moving on. Poe Dameron basically was one of the hard, tough fighters of the Resistance because he had a lot of experience growing up. However, it doesn't mean, however, he's perfect. As a matter of fact, he's a bit headstrong. A very easily character flaw. Now, before you guys ask me, is he going to meet Finn in this one? I'm not going to answer that because... That's too much into Force Awakens, which is mm. basically the first film that we see him in. Basically, though, on Jakku, which is where we do see him, however, he does have a mission. However, Jakku will probably be the last thing you're going to hear because he had a mission and a message about Luke Skywalker. Mm. Now, remember in the last video, Luke Skywalker actually left to protect the Resistance and also train himself to become a better Jedi. So anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. It's a little shorter than most, mm. but anyway, guys, hope you guys enjoy it. Anyway, I loved it. the fate of Poe Dameron will be... <laughs> Did you guys really think I was going to expose that information? <laughs> Whenever I get to the final three, you guys will know the fate of many of the characters I have talked about so far. But it's not over yet. See you guys in the next video of If I Directed Disney Star Wars. Oh, wow, that was really amazing. I really love this video, Aaron. And I gotta say, you're far better at make directing, you know, and making Poe or character development than, you know, Disney. You really did a better job, I'm telling you. Um, but yeah, this was a short but sweet video and I really loved it. So, you know the drill, guys? Be sure to give this video a like. Also, be sure to leave us all the comments what you thought of this video by, by AJ Markle. Also, be sure to subscribe to AJ Markle because the link to his, to his, his video will be in the description below. So, go check out the video for yourself and go subscribe and give him some support. Also, be sure to subscribe to my channel for this coming in the future, and I'll see you all later.